All right, guys, so the word up to date is to just remain consistent because one of the biggest things in my case anyway, when I started back posting YouTube videos, I'm going to close this door because my dog and my son are in the other room making a lot of noise. But whenever I get started back posting YouTube videos, I always do a lot in the very beginning. I always post a whole lot, maybe like one or two or three videos a day. And what I want to do today is sort of just organize my thoughts, organize my schedule and make sure that I'm able to remain consistent over the long term in terms of posting the video a day until I get to my 100 videos on the main channel and on the Tesla channel. But before I do all that, I do have a pretty busy work day ahead of me today. Since I do work from home, I do have the advantage of having a little bit more time in my day because I don't have to travel to and from work all the time. But today is actually going to be a pretty busy day and I probably won't even be able to get started on YouTube until about 8 o'clock tonight because after I get done with my work day, I have to do a group project for the master's program I'm in at Auburn University. And then after that, I'm also studying for a certification in my career field and that's going to take about two hours as well. So I'm going to try to check in with you guys throughout the day. I just posted a video on the main channel. Go watch it if you're interested in that. But I'm guessing until about 8 p.m. tonight, I'm going to get back on here and start recording for the main channel and for the vlog channel once again. Well, another quick check in before I get started started work. I did buy a couple of accessories to help me vlog a little bit more efficiently here on the channel. Right now I have to hold the phone every time and even though I do have a couple of tripods, I don't have any of one of those that hold the phone itself. So I bought one of those on Amazon and a $150 microphone for the iPhone that I, it was an expensive purchase but I'm going to make an entire video about that and along with some of the other accessories I bought so I can vlog with my phone. What did I want to say? Say hi to my little work buddy down there. He likes to chill out under the bed, under the under the futon I have in here. Just hanging out with me. Oh, I, I remember what I wanted to say. If anyone watches some of my older videos, you know I always wore a black hat like this with a cross on the top. But that hat I used to wear had gotten so dirty and filthy when I tried to wash it, it had crumbled itself and just didn't look very attractive, especially for someone who's posting it on YouTube. So I ordered this hat from AliExpress. It cost like a dollar and fifty cent. I ordered it like two or three months ago, and I just forgot about it. And I finally got it in the mail today. So I probably won't actually start wearing these in my videos again. But I'm just really happy that I got this hat. It's actually really good quality for a hat that cost a dollar and fifty cent from. China. But yeah, that's what I wanted to update you guys on. So my other worker buddy, my son Maverick. Say hey buddy. Hey. All right, you guys already know the grind don't stop. So on my lunch break, I went out in a car in the garage and recorded four TikToks. Uh, it probably took me like five minutes. I just kept the camera rolling the whole time. It actually, you know, I didn't plan on start working on that till, till about eight o'clock in the afternoon, but it didn't take me a long time. So I'm gonna take the next 15 minutes of my lunch break to finish these TikToks and get them posted. I'm just gonna post them all at once. I don't really care about the scheduling of it because it's just a new account. And that way by the 8 p.m. update, when I get ready to start editing and posting this vlog, maybe a little bit early, I'm not sure, I can, uh, at least see how those were doing and I'm also going to post one on my main channel so it'll be interesting to see how that one's doing because the one I posted yesterday gave me 10 new subscribers and I haven't been growing subscribers a lot lately so I'll see if this new one uh, grows well. It may not, I don't know, we'll see. Uh, so stay tuned for that. Alright guys, it is 4pm, the end of my work day. Actually was pretty busy today, had a couple Zoom meetings and things to, to take care of. But instead of updating you guys 8pm tonight when I start to work on tomorrow's videos, I wanted to go ahead and get this vlog uploaded and just show you the progress of those TikToks that I just posted or how they were doing anything like that. So the last 6 or 10 haven't really been doing all that well, but it is exciting because I crossed a major milestone today. I uh, even know all of the growth has come from one video but I just want to show you guys how you know this overall challenge has been going and I'm pretty excited with the results so far so stay tuned so if we look at the TikTok, we can see that in the first three days we have gotten over 10 thousand likes and we have passed the 100 follower threshold now this is really cool but if we look at the three TikToks that i posted earlier only one of them got over a thousand views and actually all the ones in the last three days only got over about 200 views so they haven't been doing great but this one video the second video I actually posted on our channel has 224 thousand views and it's basically driving all the traffic here to the uh TikTok account and then if we go into the analytics of the tesla youtube channel we can see that we're at 37 subscribers i think we're gaining or losing subscribers at this point all i know is that these shorts haven't been doing all that well but uh we can see that yesterday we got 20 subscribers the other day before that we got three and we got 12 before so i think we're averaging about 10 a day which is not bad meaning that we'll get our first 100 subscribers in 10 days which actually is pretty good 
and in the first three days of the account we got 24,000 views so overall let me know what you guys think of this series so far I think it's going pretty well I think that we'll be able to get into the TikTok creator fund within 30 days for sure if we keep up at this pace and for those who don't know the requirements to get into the TikTok creator fund is that you have to have 100,000 views in the last 30 days which we got from our second video and you also have to have over 10,000 followers so we are still lacking in the follower standpoint but from what I learned before when it rains it pours and on TikTok you can start to get a lot of followers with just one video so I'm not necessarily worried about that in that sense hopefully we can start to grow our subscribers on YouTube as well just so we can get a little bit more of that social proof people tend to follow accounts that already have followers and with this account only being at 37 subscribers it is having a hard time growing but we'll see what the future holds so I'm gonna go ahead and get this vlog uploaded and posted and then tonight at 8 p.m. like I said I'm gonna start to work on tomorrow's vlog so that I don't have to record and post in the same day I keep saying that but I keep doing it it doesn't seem to be hurting too much but I just know there may be a day in the future where I don't want to do it but until next time peace